Exciting night. The Moda Center welcomed back fans for the first time in more than a year, but there are some restrictions. Right. It wasn't packed to the rim. Just under 2,000 people could only attend the Blazers game against the Lakers tonight. And among those with the fans outside, Jenny Young. I know you spoke to a lot of excited folks, Jenny. Um, and it was an exciting night because the Blazers beat the Lakers. Yes, that's right, Jeff. It was a great night and what a win tonight. Uh, so folks had to go through mandatory health screenings uh, to get in the Moda Center. You had to do that on your Blazers app. You had to wear a mask. But people inside said that energy, just 10% capacity. You could, I mean, it just made such a difference. They said the energy was incredible and the restrictions, the mask, the health screening, it was all worth it for such an exciting night. Ecstatic, you know, uh, just pumped, just more just raring to get in. Ben Callentine, or Blazer Ben, as he's known on his podcast on the Basketball Network, pretty much summed up the feelings of most fans lucky enough to spend Friday night at the Moda Center. So I hope we get the rabid fans in here that let loose and explode and, you know, make up for the, you know, 18,000 people that aren't here. Fans EJ Lena and Jeremy Warden sent us this video from inside the stadium. Look closely and you'll notice the cardboard fans behind them. And check this out. We were lucky enough to talk to the Blazers' biggest fan and their good luck charm, 22-year-old Matty Vochter. He's been lucky enough by the Blazers to be able to go in the tunnel every game. And he has been dying at home because mm -hmm. sports, is, um, sports is his yeah. thing and there's been no Blazer games and no... Duck games. Maddie's family tells us he's been tracking an important number, 473. That's the number of days it's been since his last Blazer game. He doesn't miss them. Do you think they're <laughs> missing you? Yeah. I know they're missing you. The Vochters are season ticket holders, and when they found out fans would be allowed at Friday's game, Maddie was adamant he and his family would be here. He texted me about 100 times at work, did we get tickets yet? Dad Jim says mom didn't make it out tonight, but she's watching from home. You better say hi to mom on TV, too. <laughs> Maddie, and Maddie, what a cool kid. So he really is their good luck charm. What a big win for the Blazers tonight. Maddie's family has tickets to tomorrow's game. They'll be here. And coming up later on in the newscast, Adam will have a recap of this game. Reporting live tonight at the Moda Center, Jenny Young, Coin 6 News. Yeah, it kind of lifted everyone's spirits tonight, didn't it, Jenny? What a great story.